Hey, hello, Subchief here. Today we're going to be solving a function at x equals minus 3. And this function today is x squared plus x minus 6 divided by x plus 3. As you can see, we're going to solve for x equals minus 3. So, calculating when x equals minus 3, we're plugging in the uh, minus 3 value, minus 3 squared plus 1 times minus 3 minus 6 divided by minus 3 plus 3 that gives us 9 minus 3 minus 6 divided by 0 which is 0 over 0 now this gives us a little bit of a problem because this results in an indeterminate answer 0 in the numerator not a problem 0 in the denominator this is a problem so we've shown that f of x is discontinuous at x equals minus 3 <coughs> So, we need to find a solution to this problem. So, two popular methods. Le Hopital's rule, using derivatives and limits. Or we could use the squeeze theorem, which is finding the values right up to the line where x equals minus 3, just on either side. Or, in this uh, particular example, we could factor the numerator and avoid the undeterminate form. Hopefully we can find an x plus 3 in the numerator, then we can cancel out the x plus 3 in the uh, denominator as well, cross cancelling. So, see the numerator x squared plus x minus 6 can be factored. So, to do this, we need factors of 6, uh, which are plus or minus 1, plus or minus 2, plus or minus 3, or plus or minus 6. And what we need to find is get two of these factors multiply them together to give us the minus 6 but when we add them we get plus 1 because the function here is plus 1x and minus 6 so let's have a look what we can do so we've got the plus and minus 6 that will go with the 1 but that's not going to give us the uh, plus x so that's not going to be no good for us when we add them together so we look at the 3 and the 2 now this looks a bit more promising plus or minus 2 and plus or minus 3 so to get us with the plus 1 we need to have the 3 as the plus because that's the bigger value and subtract the 2 so therefore x plus 3 and x minus 2 gives us our factors so we're going to now um, rewrite this function as f of x equals x plus 3 times x minus 2 divided by x plus 3 now this looks a lot more promising so let's move on so, plugging in the values of what we've just found there, the factors, x plus 3 times x minus 2 divided by x plus 3, and you can see clearly that we can cross-cancel the x plus 3s, that will just leave f of x as f of x equals x minus 2. This looks really good. So, f of x equals x minus 2, just plug in the f of uh, x is when x is minus 3. This gives us minus 3 minus 2 which gives us minus 5 so therefore the solution is f of minus 3 is minus 5 so we just got that there and I've drawn a little graph here with a red pointer pointing to where it is so x equals minus 3 y equals minus 5 and that's the solution to our question so leave any comments below if you've got any questions you want to find a solution for put them in the box below and I'll see if I can uh, put up a solution for you and always please remember to subscribe thanks for watching